dear all i would like to have a brief overview of model question paper of the subject uh, waste management so as you can observe from the first module few simple questions is mentioned over here the first one is classify and explain the solid waste it, uh, it has the weightage of 10 marks so you have to explain the classific two type of classification okay so uh, with a suitable example as well question number 1b explain the functional elements of solid waste management swm you have to explain about the block diagram the generation uh, then uh, sec uh, transfer station disposal all the segment you have to mention with the help of a block diagram five marks for block diagram another five marks for explanation question number uh, 2 uh, 2a so here you are supposed to mention about the technologies there are two type of technology one is hard est other one is called a soft est okay two technology you have to explain okay 4 plus 4 another one is discuss the municipal solid waste management system in india so how the municipal solid waste management uh, is uh, taking place in our country that you have to explain with the help of a suitable block diagram so it has weightage of uh, six marks another one is very important write a brief note on global scenario of e-waste okay so uh, you need to mention about what is e-waste first it has the weightage of two marks remaining four marks will be you have to explain about the statistics so how about the uh, e-waste e-waste generation so india is almost having four to five place okay so uh, what are the contribution of our country for the e-waste generation what are the regulations which is adopting in the country those points you have to explain what is the position in the among, among the global countries in india so in india actually india is a very good market uh, compared to other uh, country so uh, obviously uh, the market the marketing of goods everything will be taking place in the country because of that more e waste is getting generated possible draw some graph based on the statistics okay question number uh, 3 which is coming from module 2 here you can observe the WSA. There is a block diagram of waste stream assessment. You can refer my PPT. Then explain the physical and the chemical characteristics of waste generation. 3 plus 3. Explain in brief. For example, physical characteristics. You have to explain about density, fine, mass, density, etc. Chemical characteristics, you can have humidity. Okay, all those things you can explain about uh, physical and the chemical characteristics. Okay, color, order, acidity, pH, all the all the points are belong to chemical characteristics. pH means potency hydride. Next is what is the effective solid waste management step to be followed to avoid the public health. So it, this is regarding the public health. So in the last year, they asked about the environmental impact. Now in the model question paper, you have seen the impact of public health. Okay, explain with the suitable points regarding uh, the spreading of diseases, all those things. Then question number 4a, explain the generation and the composition of the waste. Okay, so general question, it is having the weightage of 5 plus 5. Uh, you have to explain the waste generation then uh, and composition okay uh, discuss the handouts on solid waste composition it has having the weightage of six marks then write a brief note on e-waste generation what are the major sources of e-waste generation okay what is e-waste okay it's very important question uh, it is having the weightage of four marks at least you have to mention about three-fourths of one page three-fourths of a particular page question number uh, 5a which is uh, taken from module 3 explain the collection and storage component of waste disposal which is having the weightage of 10 marks uh, then uh, list the factors affecting the selection of transfer station okay so classify and explain the transfer station what are the different type of transfer station which are available okay based on the size we discussed about different type of transfer station and based on the vehicle okay based on the area everything we discussed Question number 6a, explain the effect of container location and vehicle stopping. Then write a brief note on motion time measurement techniques. So there are some mathematical calculation. Explain the collection vehicle routing. Okay. Uh, then question number 4, uh, question number 7a, explain the purpose of waste processing. Why waste processing are required. Discuss the mechanical volume and size reduction. So what is the purpose of mechanical volume and size reduction? There are two different methods available. Okay. Uh, it is having the weightage of uh, 4 plus 4, that is 8 marks. Next is, uh, what, uh, what is the need of uh, 
screening in the way separation type of screening so magnet uh, like uh, different types uh, you are using the semi permeable membrane what kind of screen, screening techniques are available uh, you explain you can explain in brief it is having the weightage it, it has the weightage of 6 marks question number 8a explain the different Component separation techniques. Magnetic separation you might have studied. Explain what is magnetic separation. Okay, it is suitable for the ferromagnetic material. So likewise, you have to explain three to three to four techniques. Discuss the drying and dewatering of waste processing. So you have to explain about the techniques also. What is drying? Why dewatering is required? Okay. Explain the recycling program elements. Explain with the help of a flow chart. It is having the weightage of six marks. Describe the classification of hazardous waste, K type, P, different varieties are available. Explain with the help of suitable examples. Explain the physical and the chemical hazardous waste treatment. Physical hazardous treatment has the weightage of 5 marks. Chemical hazardous waste treatment is having the weightage of another 5 marks. Regarding the question number 10, explain the process of identification of hazardous waste. At least 5 process you have to explain. Discuss the pollution prevention and waste minimization techniques. At least 10 points you can mention. Okay, so these are the important questions. Uh, this is the way how the question will be repeat, uh, asked in the university examination. For remember, for 10 marks, at least two pages are required. For six marks, at least one, one page you have to finish it off. Uh, four marks means three fourths, three fourths of page with a suitable points. And underline the points. Since it's a theory paper, you have to underline the points, try to draw the block diagram as much as possible. Some flow diagram, flow, uh, flow chart, etc. All those things can be mentioned in, in your answer book. So let me know if you have any queries. We already have a detailed discussion about the previous year question paper. So hope the uh, you don't have any doubts. Uh, if you have any doubts, kindly put up in the comment box. I'm happy to answer. Thank you so much for watching this video.